Since 2000, there have been numerous fantastic romantic comedies released. Here are some of the best ones from that period. I love the Smiths. Sorry? I said I love the Smiths. Yeah. Number 1, 500 Days of Summer, 2009. Directed by Mark Webb, this film offers a unique take on the romantic comedy genre exploring the non-linear relationship between Tom, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, and Summer, Zoe Deschanel. Number 2, The Proposal, 2009. Directed by Anne Fletcher and starring Sandra Bullock and Ryan Reynolds, this film follows a Canadian executive who convinces her assistant to marry her to avoid deportation. Number 3, Crazy Stupid Love 2011 Directed by Glenn Ficara and John Riqua, this film weaves together multiple romantic storylines with a mix of comedy and genuine emotion, starring Steve Carell, Ryan Gosling and Emma Stone. Hannah, can I buy you a drink? No. You say no a lot, don't you? No. Oh boy. Permission to approach the bench? Number 4, Silver Linings Playbook 2012 Directed by David O. Russell and starring Bradley Cooper and Jennifer Lawrence, this film explores the budding romance between two troubled individuals dealing with mental health issues. How did I do? I think I did pretty well. Yeah, she said you were cool, basically. Basically? Was I some percentage not cool? Mm -hmm. Number 5, La La Land 2016. Directed by Damien Chazelle and starring Ryan Gosling and Emma Stone, this musical romantic comedy tells the story of a jazz musician and an inspiring actress pursuing their dreams in Los Angeles. No shot, this could never be. You're not the type for me. Really? Number 6, The Big Sick, 2017. Directed by Michael Showalter and based on the real-life romance of Kumail Nanjiani and Emily V. Gordon, this film follows a Pakistani-American comedian dealing with his cultural background and the illness of his girlfriend. Wait, we haven't even had sex again yet. I'm just not that kind of girl. I only have sex once on the first date. I'm just gonna <laughs> call an Uber. <laughs> Number 7, To All the Boys I've Loved Before, 2018. Directed by Susan Johnson and based on the novel by Jenny Han, this teen romantic comedy follows high schooler Laura Jean Covey as her secret love letters are sent to her crushes. I think it's really cool that you think I have golden specks in my eyes. Oh my god, it's Josh. Oh my god. Oh, oh, okay. Number 8, Crazy Rich Asians, 2018. Directed by John M. Chu and based on the novel by Kevin Kwan, this film follows the romantic journey of a young couple, Rachel Chu and Nick Young, as they navigate the complexities of family and wealth. I met a girl, I fell in love, and I want to marry her. You're Nicholas Young, you're untouchable. But Rachel's not. Have you prepped Rachel to face the wolves? Number 9, The Half of It 2020. Directed by Alice Wu, this coming-of-age romantic comedy follows an introverted high school student who helps a Jack Wu, a girl they both secretly love. How oh, you can live in an ocean of her thoughts and she really knows it. Oh, I'm so stupid. I just meant... You like Aster? Number 10, Palm Strings 2020. Directed by Max Barbaco and starring Andy Samberg and Kristen Milioti, this film puts a fresh spin on the romantic comedy genre with its clever time loop premise set during a wedding in Palm Springs. I think so much bigger than anyone here, but always remember, you are not alone. I don't think that we met. I'm Sarah. Niles. Hi. Hi. These are just a few examples of the best romantic comedies from 2000 to the present, showcasing the diversity and creativity within the genre during this period.